Hi, this is Richard Byrne at freetechforteachers.com. In this video, I'm going to take a look at how you can create a shared Google Drive folder. This is a great way to have kids contribute uh, a bunch of pictures or videos they've taken into one folder that they can all access to use in multimedia projects like a video or a slideshow presentation. So let's go ahead and get started here and create a new folder. And we'll just call this class media resources. So we have our new folder here. Now let's get to the top of my list of items. Let's go ahead now and share this folder. And we have a couple of ways that we can share this. Uh, obviously we can put in email addresses, so I might share this to one of my other Google accounts. I can also say get shareable link and I can say anyone within my domain uh, can edit and then anyone who has the link will be able to edit and upload their own files to this same folder. I can even go here and say anyone outside of my domain who has the link can edit as well. So I'm going to go ahead and send this now to myself basically in a different Google account and let's go ahead now and open up a new tab and see what it looks like as a recipient of this shared folder. So here in my other Google account where I've shared the folder uh, I'm going to go now and see shared with me And then shared with me, I'll now see the class resources and shared by Max. That's the other account I'm using. Double click on that. And I can go ahead now and upload any file I want into this folder and it will appear for everybody who has access to the folder. Anyone who has that link will be able to access the files inside here. So let's go ahead and now upload a file to that folder. And I might just put in a picture in this case. So maybe I'm going to share this picture. And you'll see down here it's now uploaded and that's available for anyone who has access to the folder to use. So this is a great way to, to have students upload files and share them with the entire class. It's great for pictures. You can have a collection of b-roll media. Uh, if you want to upload video, or you can even upload some sound clips if you had audio recordings to share in the folder. So that's how you can create a shared Google Drive folder to use with your students. And for more tips and tricks like this, please check out freetechforteachers.com.